What's up everybody? This is Phil from Absplosion and we are playing Battle Train by Lionel Trains. They're the ones that make the little train sets since 1900. Now they're in the Apps game, which was not since 1900. That was before apps were around. For those of you who are too young to remember that time, there was a time when there was no such thing as apps. Uh, there was only sadness and boringness. Tap screen to continue on the Battle Train. This, I have to say, people who like Lionel Trains are usually not the type of people who would play something like Battle Train, but it's a cool way to bring it to this uh, dimension. So. This is a Lionel Train, and you're its engineer. Uh, do everything you can to keep your train moving in station. The sexy little lady right there, I like that. A little bit of a post-apocalyptic badass. Uh, pay attention, rookie, to switch tracks. Swipe down with two fingers. Whoop. There we go. Uh, do it again to switch up. Perfect. Uh, you can... Force robo cars off the track by cutting them off. Switch tracks in front of the robo cars. There we go. Take that, you stupid robo car. Uh, I'm gonna keep swiping around. Touch a weapon on the train to activate it. There we go. Whoa! No way! I'm gonna attack that dude. Die! Die! Well done. I know. Uh, earn coins to go over crates. Ooh! Just swipe over it like that. That works. Swiping that finger, getting them coins. If your health bar on the boxcar hits zero, you can't use the weapons on that car till you repair it. If your engine's health bar hits zero, you're derailed. And that's a tragedy. Um, cool. So, I think I'm starting to get this. Touch the repair meter. Then touch your engine or boxcar to repair it. Oh, that's super easy. Alright, I get it now. Great, now clear the remaining robocars. Will do, post-apocalyptic sexy woman. Alright, let's get up there and let's just chop that dude to pieces. There we go. Alright. Die, die, die. Die, die, die. I'm trying not to use my weaponry because I'm trying to keep it. Let's head over to the switchyard to trick out your train with powerful weapons and armor. Yes, ma'am. Whatever you say, I will follow. All right, now I'm in the train yard. Touch the box car you want to upgrade? You better believe it. I want there to be um, nuclear weaponry on the back of this. Is that possible? There's an empty weapon slot right there. Choose the photon pitch and touch purchase. This is in the future. That's awesome. The damage sucks on it, but you know what? The reload speed is good. This is like Toad from Mario Kart style. So I'm going to purchase it. There's my photon pitch. Now your train has a new weapon. This can be handy when battling multiple enemies. Thank you. All right, later if you run out of coins, you can always get more by tapping up there. Sweet, give me unlimited free coins. Tapping, tapping, nothing, okay. Uh, let's move on to the next screen. All right, educated, complete tutorial. I got the equivalent, I guess, of like a trophy from PlayStation Network. Except it doesn't mean anything because it's on the apps, right? Uh, comment below if you think that those mean something. I have no clue. It just said that I'm educated and I appreciate positive reinforcement. Uh, let's just pop into the first one here. Grainy delivery, deliver the grain. Really? I'm going to risk my life and an entire train to deliver grain? Uh, someone just blew up grain silos in plain view. This is a horrific game if you think about it. Town people need food. They're starving to death. They need grain because apparently this is the 1930s and they're all waiting in bread lines. Um, that would be the 20s. Uh, but still, that totally sucks. Uh, so I've got to feed these people or everyone's going to starve to death. And naturally, in this post-apocalyptic future, I need to have lasers on the back of my trains. Isn't it kind of weird, though, that it's the future? Oh, the photon gun is working! It's working! All right, die. Die, 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 die. Cool. All right, I'm going to swipe that, and the photon things are going to do what they do best, which is kill. All right, that was good. I'm going to drag my finger there and collect those. Uh, my train's already hurting, so I'm going to repair the front one. Uh, I'm going to switch tracks here to kill those people. Switch tracks. Switch tracks, train. Train, switch tracks. Switch tracks. Switch tracks, train. It's not working. It's not working. I'm using my two fingers and it's not working. All right. Now I'm almost dead because I spent all that time trying to swipe. And I should have been shooting, apparently. All right. Swipe up. Swipe up. Come on. You can do it. Nope. You can't do it? All right. Thank you for the knowledge. Uh, it's not working. At least my guns are working. Even though my train's not switching tracks when I wanted to. All right. I'm going to fix that boxcar there. I'm going to shoot that with that. All right. I completed my first story mission, even though I didn't do it as efficiently as possible. I'm hardcore. I destroyed 100% of enemies. Awesome work, work, rookie. I said awesome Wookie, which is cool, too. Which means it's probably time for me to stop. All right. Thank you so much for watching uh, this awesome episode 
of App Explosion. Make sure to subscribe for more awesome app reviews. This has been Phil. See you later. He's a huge fan of brains because he's a zombie. This game actually has a really good sense of humor. I like that. I like that. I don't like my zombie games to be too serious.